Ui. <laughs> Two hands now showing us ah, how to crack the nuts. <laughs> we can see this. Oh, this is quite funny. The Taedong Bokhap Terminal and the bus to the city is from that side. Obviously I walked in the wrong direction so this is where the bus stop is at the CGV. I have to walk in the opposite direction to my bus stop for the city but I just saw here Mihi Mihi. Ooh, apparently a Japanese brand for souffle cake. I need that, I'm hungry. This is the souffle cake. This is my creme brulee souffle and my cinnamon coffee latte. Sorry, I'm still without makeup. <laughs> so it's still morning for me. <laughs> so I just arrived in Taedong and here's my, my latte cinnamon. But for me it's a little bit too sweet. There's a lot of sugar inside. Anyway, and my souffle pancake. Well, <laughs> so let's let's try that one, the souffle pancake. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. The ooh creme brulee part is good, and the the pancake in itself. <laughs> Pancake in itself is nice. It's nicely warm and fluffy. Souffle. Huh? Not bad. I paid 9,200 for both. I think it's okay. I got out of the CGV whatever bus terminal complex. It's a complete different world. I'm now going to my bus to go to the Taetson train station. I just got out my bus number two to Taejeon station and it really feels I'm a little bit back in 2004 Pusan or something like that <laughs> it's funny okay so now comes Taejeon station I am going to a meditation workshop from the train station here we are meeting the workshop master Zuhei Right, we are now going to the meditation place and my friend from Guadeloupe, Thierry, just joined. So let's go and pick up another lady and then we go for meditation. We have reached the meditation village, which is actually near Songnisan. Not really Ted's on, but we got picked up there. And this is kind of our welcoming where we have to do our temperature check. And apparently there is a little surprise. Let's see. We can choose a fortune cookie with a message inside. Let's see what I got. Okay, so ooh, there's a little message, message inside. And the message, effort is never to retreat and evolution means go two steps while others go 
one step. But it is normal to go one step when others go one step. Ooh la la. I don't know if the English is correct, but uh, anyway, let's say the meaning is somewhat understood, right? <laughs> There is a cute welcome message with the schedule of our stay in English. We are going into our orientation. Our pension is very nice. Sorry, my stuff is already lying around. We can see here. Okay, sleeping room, on doll, sleeping kitchen there's the bathroom yeah <laughs> living room and sofa first we are having an orientation about this meditation stay here and to get the understanding of what is su sonze so we are sitting in a circle and we will discuss nice very very peaceful so perfect for a meditation stay tonight is also Teburum, the first full moon of the lunar new year so i hope that we are going to crack some nuts and maybe do a meditation towards the moon. Hmm, this is it. <laughs> we are now checking if my warming up yeah. is functional. Sorry for my creepy socks. You are doing very good. Can you make yeah. Relax. Relax. Do not give it. Just relax, okay? I will show you how it does. Tonight is Deborum, the first full moon in the Lunar New Year. Ah, and we have to crack the nuts. Zuhe is now showing us ah, how to crack the nuts. <laughs> Ooh. The cracking of the nuts chases away all the bad spirits. Let's crack the nuts, folks. Let's crack. Ooh. Okay. So we have to eat a lot of nuts and everything that cracks for chasing away the bad spirits so the outcome of maybe well almost one hour of painting is this yep this is how we see ourselves, meaning our outer side, our inner side. Outer side, inner side. Can you guess who that is? Outer side, inner side. Right. <laughs> this is the mess we are leaving behind with our little babushka dolls that represent ourselves from the outside to the inside. And well, the other two little dolls that are inside, we could not even paint, but this means our deeper inner self, maybe. It is 11 p.m. in the night. We are here in this village. Oh, and it's getting cold. That is our house. We are sleeping here. Good night. Good morning, everyone. It is 7 a.m. Here at the meditation stay, we are staying in some kind of 
eco village and obviously they are catching rainwater for flowering their garden which is good but also the toilet here is a little bit different let's check it out okay here we have the Sobion for Namda it looks like this the eco toilet for the ladies looks like this Ooh this goes directly into a container and most probably some ashes have to be thrown in as well so the citizens here have dumped their toilets because they are all using the kind of organic recycling toilet and for any kind of toilet paper they are actually burning it over there in that burner that you can see and they take turns to clean the toilet the remains of the toilet well our stool and all will be recycled here with ashes and sand and all the back of the toilet they put on some ashes to avoid the smell per day they are heating up that oven in order to keep a certain heat here in this vinyl house our meditation session is over we are now heading for lunch in Kwangi village we are going to eat donkas stay yes and now I'm going to explore Tedon for the first time and I received so many nice recommendations from friends from people I don't know from Facebook I'm now going to explore Tedon and I'm here in the Toyoko Inn that my good friend recommended me it really looks like a hotel somewhere in Tokyo <laughs> I don't feel like I'm in Korea and um, we are now here at the government complex or district. Here's a wonderful park and we are going to the Yukong Foot Spa or something like that. So just follow me. Yeah. Okay, by now it is already night and we are here at the foot spa experience that is right in the middle of the new downtown of Taejeon. Um, it looks pretty dark. It is now, I think, 6.30. Look, this opens at 7 a.m. in the morning, but they do not write until what time they are operating this pool. This is all free of charge and it seems that now they are under reparation. This is the other pool where you can walk in the water and sit on the specific spots. I think this is really cool actually. Okay, so this is a Milmyeon, a noodle house that has mandu and donkas and udon. So this is the food I ordered, the bibim milmyeon with some fried mandu and my friend ordered the udong with the odeng. Oh wow, look at that, cafe bless roll. Let's go inside. It is definitely too cold and too rainy outside so we came here into this fancy cafe This is what we ordered, a brownie, orange picotti and some yuza cha. Well, everyone, okay, so it's a new day here in 
Dawn and I am here at the government complex uh, area of Dedan. I stayed in the Toyoko Inn. Frankly speaking, I cannot really recommend the Toyoko Inn. It feels a little bit like you are somewhere in Tokyo in a very tiny, tiny, tiny hotel where you have only the bed and a kind of airplane-like bathroom. And the breakfast is finished at 9, even though they say it's served until 9.30. Okay. And as you see, today is not the best day. It's raining. And I have here my super umbrella from Suwon, from the Hwasong Fortress. Woo. With the royal parade of the King Sejong. <laughs> anyway, we are now going to explore further in Tejon. And obviously it's a little bit sad that it's so rainy right now because I'm not equipped with the rain outfit. But anyway, we make the best out of the day, right? So now we go to this kind of prehistoric park that is somewhere over there with a nice bamboo forest. Let's go! Everywhere in town you can find some Dule Gil. And here at this wonderful park, oh, which has a very difficult writing, Du San Son Sayu Tok Chi, we will find some prehistoric houses, bamboo forest, and more. Let's check it out. Prehistoric houses, straw houses, looks actually pretty good. This is a prehistoric house and they even made here some light detector. Oh, if we go inside, oh, we can see this. Oh, this is quite funny. <laughs> here we are at the Bronze Age pit house. Let's go inside. Mm. Uh-huh. Oh, no people inside. We are now walking the Neolithic path of the Stone Age people into the bamboo forest and into the pine forest. Look at that. That's what So now we are going to Songshim Dan here in this underground shopping. I better put on my face mask and we go to eat cake. Okay folks, I made it to Songshim Dan Bongwan on a rainy day. It rains like hell. Okay, even here at the Songshim Dan bakery, the corona check must be done. So here with a QR code from the phone or filling out the information. And the shop is full. Okay, so this is the second floor when you buy your bakery stuff downstairs. You can get your coffee and drinks here. And a little bit further in the back, you can also get some hot food, curry, omurice. And here we find another Songshim Da. A little bit more traditional feeling. I like this shop much more. They have authentic traditional stuff. Okay, so this was my stay here in Te 
it's on. I am so sorry Ooh, that it's raining so much and that all the images are so great. But anyway, this is Korea also. It's spring, it's, it's rainy and what can we do? We have to enjoy the day. Um, anyway, with this I showed you a little bit of what I saw in Taedzon. It was not much, so I will definitely come again to beautiful Taedzon. There's a lot of stuff we can see here, a lot of things you can eat. And well, I'm full now with all the Songshin Dang stuff that I ate. I have to go and catch my bus now in the rain. And with this, you know what to do. Please click like. Yes, and please click subscribe down there. Thank you. Please stay tuned and beautiful, beautiful, beautiful.